Hi, I'm Ron Wilson, host of In the Garden. Couple things for you. Going into the summer season, it's the end of May, 1st of June. Your lawn may be uh, needing a little feeding maybe to get it through the summer season. So now would be a good time to feed. If you want to stay all natural, don't forget Mill Organite's a great light, easy feed. Can't burn your lawn and it'll help to feed it all through the summer season. But this uh, would be a good weekend to get out and feed the lawn. Plants for this week, check these out. If you're looking for an annual that loves the sun, loves the heat, loves the drought, really tolerant of all of those conditions, Spushion containers are in the ground. Keep Angelonia in mind. This is the Serena series, the pinks, the purples, and the whites. Now, there are different series of Angelonias. These only get about 12 to 14 inches high. You'll find some that get 18 to 24 inches tall, but I love this. Looks like a small snapdragon flower. Tough, durable. I can't say enough about them. The Cincinnati Botanical Garden and Zoo loves this annual. They use it on a regular basis. But again, this is called the Serena series, but look for Angelonia in your local independent garden stores. Couldn't wait for this one to come along. Brand new basil out there for you. Purple basil is called Red Freddy. Now, what's so unique about this one is it's a tougher growing one. Sometimes it can be very tender, these purple varieties. This is actually a sweet Italian basil, great flavor, purple leaf, tough, and it doesn't flower till mid to late summer, so you don't have to worry about dead hanging all, all the time. But a great, great color. Can you imagine what this would look like when you make pesto with this or using it in your salads or cooking? But again, it's called Red Freddy. Look for this one to come along more and more in your uh, local garden centers. Now, what did the uh, Dram Garden Fairy bring Joe this week? Ah, look at that. He has the professional fan nozzle. Now this, again, attaches to your hose. Heavy metal, fit your hand well, all rubber, the one touch on and off, and it has this fan spray for a very gentle spray. So if you have a lot of window boxes or containers, here's a real nice light spray that you go through, does a really nice soaking, doesn't knock the flowers off, but a very gentle but nice piercing uh, spray of water. I love to use these, like I say, window boxes and planters and things like that. And Joe, you got both orange and blue handles to pick from. And you know, Joe, you can't use both of these, so again, you seem to be getting things in twos. If you would have a preference in color, I certainly could use the other one in some of my watering, so keep it in mind. So thank you very much, Dram Ferry, for providing Joe uh, with his uh, watering uh, the fan nozzle for this week. I love that one touch. Hey, for more gardening information, visit our website. It's ronwilsononline.com.